Well hello and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I have a Valentine's treat uh, taking Oreo truffles and making Valentine's Oreo truffles. This is a super easy and pretty quick recipe so I hope you enjoy. First you're going to want to put your Oreo cookies in the food processor and you're going to want to make sure to get them to a fine crumb. Then in a bowl you're going to have your softened cream cheese and then you're going to add your Oreo crumbs and your vanilla extract and you're going to mix it up until everything is nice and mixed and smooth. Then you're going to want to line a baking sheet with parchment paper and using an ice cream scoop or a cookie dough scoop, you're going to want to scoop out each truffle. You don't have to do this step, but I chose to do it. Um, once you have them all scooped out, I went ahead and put some gloves on because it makes it so the truffles don't stick to you. You can go ahead and roll them in your hand to make more of a perfect ball shape. Um, but again, this is an optional step. I can't help but notice you coming down the street. Smiling so dearly at everyone you meet And I can't help but notice you throwing me a glance A wink telling me there's a chance I've just got eyes for you I've just got eyes for you Then once you get them either all scooped or if you're rolling them, once you get them all rolled, you're going to want to place them in the freezer for 30 minutes to an hour until they're nice and fully froze. Once you get them out of the freezer, you're going to want to have your melted chocolate melts or chocolate chips. And I like to do it with taking a spoon and two knives and you put a little bit of chocolate on one of the knives and then you put your truffle on top of that 
and then you take the spoon and you drizzle the chocolate over top of it and then you just lightly tap the knife on the chocolate bowl so it completely covers it and then you use the other knife to gently slide it off onto the parchment paper could enchant me darling like you do I've just got eyes for you I've just got eyes for you Once you have those all coated, you're going to take your other candy melts or white chocolate or whatever you want as a drizzle and go ahead and melt that up and place in a uh, piping bag or in a Ziploc bag with the corner cut and you're just going to go ahead and drizzle that on. I only drizzled a couple at a time just to make sure that it was still wet enough to sprinkle these sprinkles on and that they would stick. I'm just using some two different kinds of Valentine's Day sprinkles and then I also use the strawberry shortcake yum crumbs uh, just for a couple different looks and a little different flavor on the one and then you are all ready to serve Ah. 
If you liked this recipe and video, make sure to smash that like button. Uh, if you haven't hit subscribe and the notification bell, make sure you do so you don't miss a tutorial or recipe. And as always, live, love, eat sweets.